Hi everyone, I'm Lorella. I'm not a farm girl on a homestead adventure. And today I'm gonna to talk to you about how to clip your chicken's wings. Now, this chicken, I really don't need to clip her wings. I'm moving my um, some older chickens from another coop down to the coop down here and I don't want them to go back home so I put up a temporary fence and I'm gonna clip their wings so they don't fly over it. But I'm going to do that tonight after dark so I want to make this video for you all. It's daylight. So that, that's the reason that you might want to clip your chicken's wings so they don't fly away from where you have them housed. So I want you to come in and look the at the wings. What's the problem? The duck, they're chasing it. Okay. So if you look here at the wing, we've got about three different sets of feathers. We've got here, you can see one small row of feathers, second small row of feathers, and then these longer feathers here. And there's a clear delinea delineation between this front part of her wing and the back part of her wing. These feathers right here, these long feathers, these are the flight feathers, and it won't hurt her at all to clip them. There's no blood flow in them. As long as, well, you're okay, mama, you're okay. Shh, 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 shh. I know, the ducks are being silly. As long as I stay below these other new feathers, it's fine. And I'm just gonna clip one side because that'll make her a little bit off balance so she won't be able to fly away. And tuck her head under my arm like this. And then, I can do this all with one hand. Maybe, maybe, here. Thank you, Carter. All right, I'm just gonna cut one feather at a time staying below all the new feathers. It won't hurt her at all. You can see she's not complaining. There's my hand there. I will not get your hand, I promise. Oh, close there. All right, there we go. Let me get this one right here. There we go. All right, that's all there is to it. And now she won't be able to fly because she's missing the flight feathers on one wing. There we go. All better. No problems. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you liked this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Give a thumbs up for our sweet little girl here. Ask any questions in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe and be sure to check us out on our other social media. I decided to move the ducks in here last night because they are not always easy to get in their little hutch. So since everybody's gone but me, that'd be easier just to have everybody enclosed. We'll see how it goes. Here they are, all set up in a new brooder. Let me get under here and give you a little better video. These are our guinea keats. Chewy, you could stop making noise over there. So these were a gift from our good friends. And I'm really excited about these. I don't know yet whether they're girls or guys. They bred them at home, so could be either. We'll know when they grow up because the males have what I call a beard, the red thing that hangs off their nose or off their beak. And um, the females don't. These are gonna help us keep our yard tick and flea and pest free. And my dog keeps nudging all his food bowls over there. Are you hungry, Chewy? Yeah, okay. All right, let me take care of him. I told her to stop playing on the scooter. I told her.